What's up guys, we're back with some more Bomb Crypto and today I'm going to be answering 5 important questions and I'll be giving you some really useful information. So if you are playing or planning to play Bomb Crypto, then make sure to stick around. The information I'm covering in this video is all from their Discord, so make sure to jump over there, links down below. And I've got some photos to show off, so massive shout out to the users that created these. Keep in mind guys, the information in this video is subject to change based on the game. If they do change or I get something wrong, I'll definitely pin it in the comment section down below. So let's get into it. Alright, we're starting off with some really important information so you guys don't get your accounts banned. At the moment, there is a max of two different accounts per IP. If you have more than that, then you are at risk of getting your account banned. This could change in the future because they are currently upgrading their servers. So keep an eye out for any announcements about that. And of course, don't risk using multiple accounts because there's a good chance that you will get banned. So there have been a few nerfs to chess rewards since launch which does suck, but it is better for the game and its economy long term. As of right now, wood chests will have 0.0125 Bitcoin, metal chests will have 0.025, gold chests will have 0.125, and crystal chests will have 0.25 Bitcoin. There is a treasure chest there, which is the same one that you use to claim your tokens, so I don't believe that's in the game for us to destroy, but if you guys have found one of these, then let us know in the comments down below. We've also got the chest health if you're interested in that. And of course, cages will give you hero resources, which is 10 B coins each. I know a lot of people are having trouble claiming their coins and their heroes. The devs have recently posted an announcement saying that they are fixing this over the next few days until the 13th of October. So we'll just have to be patient until then. If you guys are curious about your chances of getting a high rarity hero, checking out this table, we can see that it's 82.87% for a common which actually feels more like 99% in game. We have 10.36% for a rare, 5.18 for a super rare, 1.04 for an epic, 0.52 for a legend, and 0.04 for a super legend. If you guys want to simulate hero summonings, you can check out this really useful website. I'll have a link down below. And shout out to Blade Mistu over on Discord for creating this. If you're interested, you can support him by making a donation. You can simulate summonings, check out how many B-coins you get from each chest, see how much damage bombs do to chests and find out how much time it'll take to fully regenerate stamina based on your hero stats. So a really useful website to have a look at, which also leads us to our next question. We can see how many minutes it takes to recharge stamina based on the hero stats and also with the ability that gives you 5 energy per minute. And we can see why the passive energy ability is the best ability in game. It takes a 1 stamina hero from a 10 minute recharge to only 9 minutes. So if you guys do have this ability on your heroes, then definitely make sure to set them as active. And for my whales out there, here are the recharge rates with each house. And even with just a tiny house, you're getting 4 times faster recharge speed than normal. And it gets insanely fast with the higher tiers. But keep in mind, they are super expensive. If you guys pulled a lot of common heroes, and they're just sitting in your inventory, don't worry, you can still make use of them in the future with the hero upgrades feature and this should be coming in around late October or early November. And how this will work is you guys will need one bomber hero that is the same level as the hero you want to upgrade. So if your hero is level 2 and you want to level them up to level 3, then you need to use a level 2 bomber to merge it together to upgrade that hero to level 3. So here's a little table on how much Bitcoin it will take to get your heroes from level 1 to level 10. So level 1 is just 10 B-Coins and it goes all the way up to 5,120 B-Coins for a level 10 hero. So it is quite expensive, but I'm sure these heroes are going to be super strong in the game. And keep in mind that this is just an early concept of how the hero upgrade will work. It is subject to change, but we'll just have to wait and see what they release. But I hope you guys found this video useful. If you did, then make sure to leave a like so more people can find out about this information. And if you guys want to learn more about Bomb Crypto and other play-to-earn games, then don't forget to sub to the channel. And I'll see you in the next one.